Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Tim Tim with me, Jalanon at Lunar Nebula Gaming. Today, we're finding fake Bell Sotos. And, oh, there is somebody in the middle. Well, okay then. I think we will, yeah, we'll do the big circuit and then come back, and that's probably Telebos in the middle. That's my guess. Good place to take a nice little break away from the Sarge. Ahem, hello, fellow pilgrim. I'm sorry I didn't see you there. Tim Tim out, Bell Soto scum. Bill Soto who? Me? No, I'm not a wait. My hat. It's too obvious. Well, okay then. Clearly not a captain, so he cannot be Captain Obvious, sadly. Okay then. We could probably do our normal style of stuff. However, uppercut is super effective here, so is Marshall Strike, so we'll do that instead. I will probably have to go back to town and heal up once, at least, before we get finished with everything. Well, Valash, you're done. Take a break. But just don't break off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. It's too many calories for you and your speedy nature. Hmm. Okay, then. Double level up. Drakash. Aw, oh, I really wanted a good Drakash. Alas, I have not. Been successful. Uh, probably gonna take out Drakash with this. Even without the heat up. Maybe not, though. No, I was correct. Okay. Yay! I am also on fire. Less yay. Okay, the suplex did some good work, though. However, the nature damage is probably incoming. Yep, and that is a really good ability. Took out size much, man. Well, okay, then. Melokoton, you need some XP. Get your doggy behind in here. And wag that little tail to show that you are ready for victory. There you go. You are ready for victory. And now, Skunch, can you provide victory now? Yep. No little bit of red there this time. Okay, then. Good work, team. Tar Nation, I'm out of here. That's right. Get yourself out of here, Bell Soto. Hmm. Give me some stickers. Ha ha, a Platox. It is damaged. Hmm. Unfortunate. Uh, you're probably a normal person. Negative contact over here. Blue eye over. Yeah, no. I suppose all priests have radios. Yes, it's for... Hey, wait, what are you... Nope, you had a better disguise, though. Psypat and Nyx. It's all in the mix. Okay. Well, Gazuma's gonna be good here. I think we just... Double up on the Saipat. Ah. I am dead. DC beam wasn't fast enough, huh? That is unusual. And the Saipat didn't use its, like, Nicho Sai thing. Huh. Not the Nugi. I need my noggin. Okay, we can send out Melakaton. Then we send out Flatamissa. Okay, Platamus. Show them why you are the best. And the brightest. Hmm, I think we keep doing some damage there. Yeah, we'll just focus one of them down. There's only two. Aha, here's your fast move. It is rather painful. Like gravity. Well, Platamus, you're taking this like a champ. Unfortunately, it looks like they will have access to their moves still, and will probably overexert. Hmm. Can we KO the side path? Yes! Okay, good. The 30% extra damage from Bully probably helped there. Good. Hmm. The real question is... Do I Toxic Slime try to get the Bully to activate, or is Aqua Bullet Hell just better here. And I think Aqua Bullet Hell's just better here. 
if we survive. Well, good thing I didn't play him on the bully to Brock. Huh. Okay, and you did damage yourself, though. Take that. Hmm. I think we send out our doggo. Alright. That's right. Your bite is just as bad as your bark. Even though you're not tree-like at all. Okay. Yep. That's what I figured. But oh well, you will have access to Undermine. Hmm, this thing's pretty fast though. Nibble has the same priority, so yeah. Venomous Claws is faster, so we're gonna try for it. Yep, half damage, is it enough? Okay, Ooh. I was cautious. Retreat, I'm retreating. Anyone there acknowledge Telebos Central? Nah. Nobody's paying attention to radios. That's old technology. Hmm. Pretty sure I've already used my Tomessence file, yeah? I have three Tim remaining. This leads me to believe I should probably leave and get healed. Okay, are you guys gonna... You're not gonna start anything, huh? Why was there a... Okay, well, I thought I saw there was a star all the way up here. Uh-huh. That's a secret code. Okay. Probably you have to rearrange the letters in a certain order. Hmm. Or, even more likely, you have to substitute them based on a cipher. I'm kind of hoping we find some Tim here. Just one other reason I'm cutting across. Yes, new tin. Maybe. Unting Nestla. Okay. We have a Nestla, thanks to our friend from Tukma, the donated one, generously to our escape. This one's level 64, though. We're going to try for it. Uh, we'll also try... Just uh, sitting here real fast. Good. That probably won't KO. I didn't DC beam in case that healed it. Platinum this might go down. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We could replace Kazuma if this thing is better. Kazuma's worked really hard for us this whole game, though. Hmm. And it has the wind typing, which is nice for us. So, will you join the team? Ayo. Another Nestler. Okay, it's not great. But it does restore HP instead of take damage from electric, which is pretty nice for a swap in, potentially. Hmm. Its special attack is actually decent, so is its speed. It's got decent stats, even if its SVs aren't the best. Huh. Well... Hmm. I think for now, we consider it. Because, like, okay, just as an example, Gazuma. Your special attack is higher than that thing's. Probably because of your trained values. Because we'll get all those trained values by the time you reach, like, level 100 or something, right? Hmm. So no, Kazuma's still currently better at the moment. So we'll, we'll keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. All right. Well, now that I'm all healed up, it makes sense to kind of go to this nearest one. So we'll do that. I did move Art Doggo to the front. Shh! Don't look now. That pilgrim over there to my right—he looks a bit suspicious. Trying to divert suspicion from you, are we? What? What are you implying? Nah, she's probably legit. But you never know until you check. Alright. OV10 and M for two. We got a little bit of something something for the both of you. So I think we save up for Fire Tornado. Let's just work on this thing over here. 
I wish Scarabolt had some more stamina. Hmm. Maybe I should put some trained values in there. All right then. We'll see how this goes. Uh-uh. The lightning, though. That was... Huh. That does actually help your amphitheater, though, doesn't it? I think we refresh to set up. Uh, I'm no longer exhausted. I think I still do DCB. There we go. Okay. Painful. But I lived. Hmm. Well, I was thinking I would use my Undermine on OB10, but I don't think I'll need it. I think I just nibble you. I mean, Fire Tornado you. Hmm. My doggo! Hmm. That was a huge overexertion. Okay. So yeah, I think I'm still happy with my choices here. Yeah. Yeah, that deer would have gotten that strike off regardless. Enjoy the fight. All right. You get to take a load off. And now, we are more prepared for the next... Ooh, Electric Storm. Okay. So that could be better than Thunder Strike. I think it is for us, because we don't have an AoE move with Scaravolt. So yeah. As good as Thunder Strike is. I think we're happier with Electric Storm in this case. So now we can Undermine, but who... Sparzy would probably just go down, right? Mulgu. Can't remember what your exact typing is. I think we undermine you. And then Sparzy is electric type. I think I just wait. Get some stamina back. Oh, okay, Mulgu done. Alright then. Hey you. Little robot noises. That is fine. I wonder why it attacks Scaravolt. Is it randomly choosing? Hmm. I wonder. Oh no no. Ah! Wait, what just happened? Okay, good. It sounded like it moved to Scaravolt. But here we go. Give me that wheel of power. Mm-hmm. And then use a little bit of earth breaking. There it goes. Victory. Okay then. Hmm. I hope I'm not under suspicion anymore then. Can you check that guy please? Yeah, I will. No idea who I can trust here. Right, moving on. I should check everyone in this zone before we make a play for Telebos. Correct. Also another sticker. Okay, tree, get out of my way. Ooh, an Okan. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Again. You're not even pretending to be a pilgrim. Why should I? I should hope by now you remember my face. Make a little effort. The narwhal, the prison in Quetzal, Kiziwa, any bells rung? Um, uh, why are you following me? Perhaps I have a professional interest in you. You've come a long way. Not as much as the Congress seems to believe, but impressive progress anyway. You're definitely your mother's son. So you're Bel Soto? Don't be daft. If Clay and Bel Soto had someone like me at the helm, never mind in their ranks, they would have already conquered the whole archipelago. No, happily for you and both of us, I'm not a friend of Clay and Bel Soto, but I am fond of my current neutrality. I'll kick your butt anyway. I will choose my weakest, Tim Tim, and use only the most basic tactics so that you stand a chance. Ready? Hit me with your best shot. So he's probably like the champion champion character in this game, right? Stowaway. <laughs> that face, though. Like I eats and roll it. Ah. Indeed. I'm in danger. Deceit aura. Okay, okay. I see what's going on here. And then DC Beam is actually pretty good against mental. Hmm. I, uh... I think this will be slightly different. So I'd like to bring in Size Munch for the roller. 
Okay, well that wasn't terrible. My defense went down. Hmm. Straw shield, are you gonna... Okay, wow, did that much even through my straw shield. Okay. That is a bad sign. And it's fast enough that DCB didn't go first. That's just bad news bears. So I think I kind of have to try to still be fast. Yeah. I mean, another DC beam will take out this glass cannon. Okay, your special defenses aren't that good. That's nice to know. Hmm. Okay, no. No! Don't attack Scarable. And we'll be fine. Oh, you hit everything. Well, good thing we have Gazuma. I think I'll send out Platinus. It should be better than... Oh, well, you just used up all your energy. I am not adverse to that. Okay. Kazuma. Platinus. I choose you. Hmm. Behold, the fakest of beards. And yet, it has a refined elegance, doesn't it? And I believe you're weak to walk. Yeah. Okay. I do like the roller design. I would want one. Okay. First two taken down. But there are two more Tim Tim. Level up. Pocus and Babala. Okay. Mm, electric Storm should help with both. Tsunami's not going to do much to the Babawa, but it probably has Mucus to make our Toxic not as good anyway. So I think I Tsunami just to try to take out the Pocus. Yeah. That's my theory. Yep. If only we could inflict another good freeze move. How? My skin? And my bones. But now we can see yours. Apparently you didn't like that, did you? Okay. Mucus works on electricity, too. Hmm. Should pay more attention. Ouch. Took a licking, but I'll keep on kicking. Kurgan. With that in mind, I still think electricity is our best bet here. And some poison. Okay. Yeah, your mucus... Did not do a very good job there. Hmm. We are content with this result. Very passable. Almost acceptable. Well done. And now, before you start with the questions again, until next time. All right, Stowaway. If that is your real name. It's probably not. Guy and Tradings. Hmm. Okay. I have 410. I guess we just try this. Greetings. Welcome to the abode of the spirits. Please be respectful towards other pilgrims. Sorry, I have to fight you just in case. What is this? Some sort of bizarre test? From the head priest? Maybe. Salpi, get ready. She has one tip. Well, that makes sense that she wasn't prepared for a fight. Okay. Do we believe her? That's the real question. DC Beam? And you're probably not that weak to Toxic. I don't think water would do any better, though, right? I could be wrong. We try. Take that, circuitry. Okay. Ah, oh, close. Well. Electro punch. Ooh, my face. My fakely bearded face. We'll just try to go fast. Sonic. Would be proud. DC beam, save me. Excellent. Directly to the heart of the manor. A. Hey. Well, a decent battle anyway. Indeed. And now we leave you anon. A priest, no doubt. Crossed off my list then. Wait a second, you have a quest for me. Are you satisfied that I am not, in fact, one of those Belsoto thugs? I apologize for doubting you. I am now. That is understandable. We live in a world of appearances, and what is true on one side of the Tori might not be so on the other. 
one should not judge from surface impressions. What do you mean by Tory gates? Like that one over there, or that other one? For us Sapanki, they mark the entrance to a sacred place. This lake? Well, yes, this is a holy place indeed. But that is not what the Tori indicate. In some ways, this lake is in fact an antechamber to the truly relevant place. There is no one way to denominate it. But for lack of a better word, at Miyako, we tend to call it the high below. Mmm. Not the high above, not the down below? In between. Meaning? It is far above this place, but it is also underneath it. In one way, in a spatial sense, and in another way, in a temporal sense. It is as far away as it could be, and it is also superimposed on the same ground we stand upon. I see the confusion in your face, dear pilgrim. I'm sorry I cannot explain it in more understandable terms for a lay person, but that is the true nature of the high below. If you really are interested in such a matter, perhaps our high priest could help you. His understanding of these things is naturally superior to mine. Can't you give me the executive summary? The Tori are thresholds to another world. There. What? I told you, the simple explanation is so pale and weak as to be completely misleading. Our leader might know of a better way to explain it to a tamer. Well, that seems pretty accurate. Okay. Because they talked about the mini spheres theory with one of the NPCs. Hmm. Or something like that. So I technically have four Tim Tim. I think we'll try. My dog isn't getting XP, though. Who are you? Sergeant Jalon from Clan Bell Soto. I'm so sorry, sir. I didn't know. <laughs> Can't believe she fell for it. Okay. That's why you try. Because sometimes you get your guy. Or gal. In this case, is probably. Kind of hard to tell. At the moment. When I'm more focused on not dying. I hope to not die. Hmm. I think we win blade you. What bullet hell? Zinnereth is more of a problem. Yeah, okay. Oh dear. Well, I was right about my problems. Catfire, please don't be faster than Platinus. Okay, well, you've made yourself more of a threat. This is true. Oh, I thought you were weak to water. No. Okay. Well, size munch and scotch. I'm gonna need you. Okay. Uppercut you. Tsunami everything. And we hope this goes. Okay, good. As expected, Capire's a little bit weaker. The punch will require a scudge. Probably. Oh my. Rampage, how good is that? Yeah, still not that good, even with that heat up. That's the thing, Rampage just doesn't seem worth it. Unless there's some other way to make it better. Hmm. Otherwise, not super... dramatically impressed. I think we just Martial Strike. Whatever survives. Behold. Rock on. Rock off. The martial arts technique of the ages. Okay then. Scudge could work. Alert! We must warn Telebos the landing zone is compromised. Okay, yeah, did we think that through? Did we, you know, wonder about them maybe letting everybody else know that there's a problem? Hmm. We did have a bunch of people here before. Uh, hi. How goes the pilgrimation? Fight me, Bel Soto. Ah, uh, what gave it away? <laughs> oh man, the pilgrimation. Hmm. Like an animation for pilgrims or something? I wonder. Okay, well, I think we go for the Mastione. Our electrical move should be decent, because it's water fire. And our nibble is pretty much always a thing. You're just toxic, Mushuk. Just toxic. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's hope he doesn't use a super effective water move, but he probably will. Well. That looks very amazing. Huh. Good thing my doggo is so good with its stats. Okay, I can just undermine something. 
I think I do my refresh and Electric Storm. Hopefully, Electric Storm will be faster than Mastion. Mmm, that's not great. Okay, at least you're overexerted. I think this will take this guy out. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Ooh. You know, I expected the shark to be faster, but I'm glad it wasn't. So I... I guess really I didn't expect it to be faster. I thought... Maybe they tried to make it look, look kind of like Garchomp. Anyway, anyway. All that said, meaning... Time to undermine the competition. Okay, we are in danger from this Oceara. This is true. However, consider electricity. Boom. Okay. I am probably dead. I'm not dead. All right then. Undermined. Good job. Get that experience. I might switch out Melikaton just so I can get the XP for sure. I think that's worth it. You can send in Kazuma. Also worth it. Then I could Earthbreaker, and it will turn into electricity. Yes? Yeah. The only problem... And it isn't even really a problem, is my priority, though. I think I still try for it. Because the switch happens first. We've tested this before. It works. Synergistic. Okay. Well... We have problems. It's faster, which makes perfect sense. It looks like a deer versus my scarab boy. All right. Hmm. Well, I could send in Melkatone again, but I think. Hmm. I think I just send in Platinumus. Give our best performing Tim even more XP. And it'll also speed up our victory here. Toxic Slime. Take that. Do, 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 do. Poison probably wouldn't KO. Okay. Barely survived it. I don't even see the red on that bar. Okay. Well, it worked. It worked. There we go. I told the Sarge this disguise was a stupid idea. Well, you did a better job than some of the others. I'll give you that. Hmm. Do we care? Oh, wait, there's somebody in the water over here. All right, then. Zzz. Hey, I'm sorry, but I have to wake you up. Zzz. Hey, what's going on? Sorry, who are you? Apologies, but I have to fight you. If to find me, why? What the down below is just a little battle, really. It will make sense later. Uh, why? How, 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 how do? Well, enjoy this rude awakening. Ah. Hmm. What do we do here? Nibble the Nidrasil. Windblade as well. We hope we don't die before we get our damage off. Yeah. Okay. My doggo! You did good. But unfortunately, we're not getting you enough XP. I need to fix that somehow. Saku probably takes out Kazuma here. Yep. Okay, this guy's only got two Tam. Hmm. We should be fine. I think I go Skunch and Platymus instead of Size Munch. We'll save Size Munch for later, but nature moves are super fed against Size Munch. I'll try for that and. Hmm. I get Venomous Claws. It's probably worth it. I mean, with the Invigoration up, maybe I should have just Toxic Slimed anyway, because it's more damage. Oh, the turbine. Oh, that is so much more damage. Ah, you have air specialist. That makes sense. Did you survive that? Okay. But I was going to say, I couldn't even see the little redness. Okay, we savagely suplex and we toxic. 
the slime. Take that. Slime time. Hmm. Bonk. Poison might do it. But uh, Platypus might go down here first. Yep. Okay, Scott should get more experience. Venomous, you did good. All right, then. What? Yeah, sorry to wake you up there. What the down blow was that about? Okay, you can go back to your nap now. Unbelievable. Maybe I'm taking this Belsado hunt a step too far. Probably not. But now it's done, other than right on there. So I will once again make the trek back to the healing. And, uh, yeah, we'll see if this is New Tim first. New Tim? Ooh, Psycrox, okay. So are you completely separate from Chromion? Oh, because I thought you were related. This appears to be incorrect. Also, I have no idea if you're weak to this. Yeah, you're not. Okay. Uh, maybe I should have revived some Tim first. I keep forgetting you're pretty high level in this area. Wastewater. So far, so good, though. Okay, no toxins. And what else you got? Poison. Yep. Yep, yep. Okay. Well, I think we just throw out two Tim cards. And then if one catches, we might get a second one. Hey. Psychrox. What a synthesizer. Hmm. Wait, that's even better than electric synthesizer? Huh. Oh. And your digital toxic? And your stats aren't terrible, other than your speed, but frankly that looks like a dump stat anyway. Ooh, you're a valid switching. Well, but your current stats are pretty low still. Interesting. Hmm. But your SVs are good. So maybe you're not as good as I think you are. Okay, well, that one broke free. What a waste of water. Alright, just don't go down Scunch and you'll get some XP out of this. Okay, but we have now caught a Cyclox. No. Now we suplex it into oblivion. Is this super effective? No. Hmm. It is a lot of damage, though. Okay. Behold. These two rocks I pulled out of the lake. Take that. Alright then. Well, we're pretty happy with that result. We get a new Tim Tim. Excellent. Let's go heal up and come back. Alright, dear viewer. Here we go. Probably to the last defender of the Telepos. Hmm. Hello. Don't bother me, I'm doing priestly chores. Like filling water buckets for a telos? Exact- Ah! Come here, you smarty pants, I'll teach you to mess with the clan. Alright. The clan with a plan, apparently. Rollerend and Momo. Wait. Momo? Okay, so you did have a Prevo, or...? This is a name that Carlos gave you. So it's a nickname. Oh. <laughs> well, now we've learned. Um, I'm in danger. I think we go for the Volarind because we can do super effective damage to it with DC Beam, even though it's not much. Oh, dear. Jaw Strike? Sounds like a better nibble. Okay, okay. Well, I'm glad we went to heal. Hmm. Yep. Every day I'm nibbling on cookies and things. Because you're a good dog. Okay. Hmm. Could willpower drain. Could refresh. I think refresh makes the most sense. Electric storm also makes sense. Hyperkinetic strike. Oh my. Okay, well, I was thinking of Switching out my dog so it could get XP. It might still have 
actually. Hmm. I think they're just both too fast for me to... Oh. I guess I should have done willpower drain just so something useful could have been done. Uh, okay. Well, I need you to get the experience. We'll switch to Kazuma. Whereas you will then have an electric type here. I think DC Beam will just be enough to take it out, though. As long as it's faster than the other doggo. Momo. Okay, that could be very bad. Yay! We did it. Okay, so my Momo will not turn into a flying lemur, I am sure. Okay. Painful. Hmm. What is, I guess I don't have anything super effective against normal type. We have toxicity, though. Poisoning doesn't care what type you are unless it's toxic. So it, it actually does care what type you are. Hmm. Oh well. So Electric Storm does more damage for us. Alright then. Uh oh. Kazuma! I'm trying very hard. So it's probably gonna start willpower draining me, right? That would make sense anyway. Okay. Hmm. I think we send out size much to just get more of our heaviest taters out. I could heat up. I don't know if it's worth it. I think we just uppercut for damage and keep adding poison. Yeah, jaw strike. It's like 70 damage. I guess it's more like 68, but yeah, who's counting? Who's counting? But I'm betting with the poison damage combined with our other stuff, it should be close to going down here. Slash, go down. Go down here. Oh my goodness. I can see the barest hint of red. Yet again. Hmm. We're gonna try to go fast. There we go. Okay, and our Momo Melocoton will get some good old XP. Where's that smoke bomb? Ah, there. Oh, ninjas. That's it. Another region efficiently cleansed of Belsoto scum. Let's get back to Carlos. We're ready to storm that flying castle. Ninjas, ninjas. Look out for Shinobi. Also look out for stickers. Hmm. Okay, I don't see one. Okay. Well, I guess we could head into this. Seems interesting. But we'll do that next time, dear viewer. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more Tim Tim. And have a great day.